Football is a violent game, and there's been a great deal of attention at all levels on brain and head injuries. Some athletes are leaving the sport because of the risk. But there's a revolutionary helmet called the Vices 01 that appears to be a game changer. My first reaction when I put it on was just in awe. 1,200 high school programs and 150 professional and college teams across the country now use the Vices 01 helmet. Packers quarterback Aaron Rodgers fitted five high schools from his native California with the Vices. It's considered the most technologically advanced helmet on the market, designed to reduce impact forces with a highly engineered structure that differs from traditional helmets. The Vices 01 has a deformable outer shell and unique layer designed to slow impact forces, much like a car bumper. Instead of uh, absorbing all that impact and all of that energy going to brain tissue, they're able to deflect and even in minor sorts of ways. And to have a helmet that's able to deform uh, and then to recoil and then do that again is very impressive. The St. Norbert College Green Knights football program currently has five of the Vices helmets, but head coach Dan McCarty is sold and would like to fit his entire team. Like any new technology, the helmets are not cheap at nearly $1,000 a piece, but McCarty believes you simply can't put a price on the health of student athletes. To me, we got to do whatever we can to the best of our capabilities of putting our kids in the best equipment to, to protect them from any head injury. Running back Nate Eilenfeldt is one of the five players currently using the Vices. He wore it for the first time in the Green Knights' victory over UW-Eau Claire. But I definitely noticed a difference, um, especially like I said before in the uh, in the little hits. So there's little times you'll you know you get popped around a little bit and then you'll, you'll hit the ground, not super hard, but just something that's in every every play type of thing. And it seemed to just make those little hits disappear. Like I didn't feel them nearly as much as I would um, in the past. Helmet laboratory testing results released by the NFL Players Association in 2019 ranked the Vices 01 number one for the third straight year. Coach McCarty said the helmets hold up very well in cold weather and the word is spreading fast. From what I've been told, uh, programs that are going to this helmet um, are seeing an increase in participation. So, you know, I think parents realize the importance of protecting, right, their sons and they see programs taking all the precautions they can to do that and, and they feel much safer, you know, with their son playing the sport. For more information about the Vices 01, visit www.vices.com. I'm Mike Counter for St. Albert College.